confined to darkness, a fate which cuts the thread of life, signaling it's time to bring in the fruit in that treacherous tower of hunger. Like water taking the shape of its captor, my eyes tasted a grief so profound there was no outlet for tears or fears. I have seen those who journeyed by repentance, swaying on a cliff of regret or inspiration. Which is it, I ask you? A step up or back down into the refuse-covered selfishness of domination? Is it easier to climb a holy rock or chase a holy grail? Is it easier to be grateful for the fall? or to writhe in misery because the climb is too difficult if one can only crawl. Fatigue crawls down the river. Ambition kneels in surrender to forces of dubious motives. The sky reveals itself in aim, illusion. Are you repentant? Spent in lost directions. Say farewell to damage. Leave it on that runway of forgotten cities where time left imprints on seedless sands. Who will remember? Or will they? Because their defeat may be yours. Stand naked before ruin. Your body covered in welts too buried in confusion. When all the doors are closed, does God really open a window? And what lies on the other side? Is it a valley of green terraces flowing into a stream of reason or truth? You step into a river. Rocks surrender their edge into your feet. Crimson ribbons wrap realization about your ankles. Marred branded, branded with indignity, your breath trickles and whispers, taciturn tears in the shape of a note, staccato, forlorn, a denouement to battle, lost to the forces of darkness. Can you hear the music of regret wading down the ravine of addiction to ego to greed? Can you surrender to stillness, to light, to sound, reach for higher ground, return passion to compassion, be a rose in remorse? There is a way to swim out of the night circle of hell, I tell you. There is a way. Go back. Go back to the river a second time, all the way back, and reach, reach, reach into the womb of healing waters and sleep, sleep, until a pulse returns and a cry announces life. Oh. 